back and they're off jumping away awkward from the gates was Rahel al Wathbar has surely given away all chance of success from there and is trailing by six or seven lengths at the back of the field but early on Tawaka al Shahib is making a forward move so too is Lady Di flashing his tail also up on the outside the orange and black jacket of Haydar to make a line of three and they are already two or three lengths on then of Tarbea al Naif with the white headgear also a similar color jacket of uh, Hebar is up with the pace. So too uh, is Prince Amar caught wide on the course. Back towards the inside, Harab is probably about seven or eight at the moment as the runners go down the side of the course and approach halfway. And towards the inside, we have the orange sleeves uh, on the inside belonging to Prince Amar. Also up with the speed is Lady Di. And Lady Di may be just going on now to in third position, Al Yal getting a first mention, racing in front of Easta de Soleil, who has made some good ground into fourth. Just moving up into a position now, Prince Amar now in fifth place, followed by Heber into the race. And the orange and blue is Alizia. The green sleeves of Tawaka Al Shahib probably has three or four lengths to find on this front runner, which continues to be the prolific Lady Di who swoops into the lead now and Lady Di now goes on to Umbab who has emerged as one of the leading threats in second place right down the outside Easter de Soleil has every chance with Al Yao going up the rail as they race into the closing stages Lady Di now being challenged by Easter de Soleil and Easter de Soleil now pours on the pressure and goes on in the closing stages Easter de Soleil makes it a double for Mohammed Al Habal second is Lady Di possibly third going in the direction of Al Yal, who went the shortest way. Well, Easter de Soleil has come down the centre to win in good style in a slow motion finish here to this 0-70, but has won it pretty well for the second time in her career. She will head to the winner's enclosure, Mohamed Al-Khabel, the second time this afternoon.